Hey guys, I'm Jordan. And I'm Barry. And we are the Brownstone Boys. A lot has been done in our place over the last couple of weeks, so we wanted to take you inside and give you an update. So we're here in the front bedroom right now, and we're really excited because this is one of the first looks we're getting at the recently sanded flooring. And if you remember, the flooring we had before, um, well, was this flooring, but it had this really kind of awful whitewash finish on it. It actually made the flooring kind of look like not real wood. A lot of people saw it and thought it looked like it was laminate or something. But turns out it was really beautiful white oak solid marble flooring. So sanded off that whitewash finish, and we really love it. It looks so nice. Um, just like it is, so uh, we weren't quite sure what kind of finish we were going to put on, but we decided to go ahead and do a very natural finish, so it'll be very similar to the color you see here now, maybe a tiny bit darker, um, and we're going to put a very matte finish, so we're going to go with Bona um, for our waterborne uh, finish, and it's going to be extra matte, and the other color traffic HD is the, the uh, line that we decided to go with. So, we have a 90 pound lab that runs around and slides on the floor and uh, we understand that that's the best to make sure that you don't see scratches and dust as well. So if you guys want to come inside the guest bathroom, a lot has been done. Barry and I couldn't be more pleased with the progress of this bathroom. Uh, as you probably noticed, we have added some tile work. Uh, we went with the classic subway tiles over here on the walls, 3x6. Uh, this just gives it the classic approach that both Barry and I wanted for this bathroom. And the ground the tile, I'm just obsessed with. I think it looks great. It's a black and white hex. Uh, we're going to add some contrasting grout work this week. And then, of course, we have the fixtures in here. But this is probably going to be the first room to be absolutely complete. And we just are so happy with the progress. Let's go over to the master bedroom. We'll, we'll show you guys what we have going on there. And you can see as we go through a lot of the woodwork that was stripped. Um, it's a little dusty right now, but it really came out nice. And we're trying to decide right now how much of it we're gonna keep natural and how much we're, we're gonna paint. We may paint some of it um, back too. So not much of it, we wanna keep as much natural as we can, but we also don't want too much wood in the place that makes it really dark. You can see the, the window casings that were stripped here as well. One thing that we have to do is, is get new doors. We have these um, hollow doors that we're putting in here, so we want to get rid of these. Um, and we also have to keep up with molding. We want to cover one around the door, so we still have to do that. As far as the base molding here, um, it's original, so we weren't able to buy any more of it. As you can see, we'll need to fill in gaps um, you know, from where it, it isn't existing right now. But we were able to find a place to remake this movie for us. Um, so um, they already ran it, it's already been produced, and so now we just have to pick it up and put it in. Come inside the master bathroom. We're at the very beginning stage here, but it's worth showing. The tile work has been uh, added right now. We're in the very beginning stages. This is a four inch hex tile from Fire Clay Tile. You want the charcoal gray color. The grout will be contrasting, so it will really bring out that gray. On both sides of the walls, we're gonna add a square white tile, really give it a pop of color, and then we have a custom vanity going in for this side. We cannot wait for this bathroom to be finished. So one thing that we cannot wait to see is what is under this carpet. It's coming off this week, uh, finally. We left it on all this time because it's kind of protecting the stairs a little bit, so there's no point in even taking it off yet. But we're really curious what the condition of the stairs are under there, so hopefully we'll have answered that question this week. So we're here kind of in the kitchen area in the back of the building. And um, what's really cool is the, this woodwork was all just stripped. It's actually the final stage of the process of stripping this wood woodwork. It just finished and it came out really, really nice. You can see so much detail um, that was all just covered and so much paint before. And it really came out um, really great. So the next step for us is to put the door that is going to lead to the deck that's actually going in over the next couple of weeks. Um, and we feel like this side of the house will be pretty close to finished. The deck is still being worked on. Uh, if you guys just want to take a look outside, you can kind of see the holes are getting deeper. <laughs> uh, we are getting our posts ready to be installed this week. 
hopefully next week we can report with report from our deck. <laughs> uh, we hope you guys enjoyed the update. Make sure to follow us on the blog and also follow us on Instagram at Brownstone Boys. Bye guys. Bye.